four days until Christmas morning and it's crunch time. You may likely have some wrapping to do and we want to help you out with some ideas that will take your presence to the next level. Joining us now is Sandy Sandler, the creator of Bodabra, a tool that can help you put the perfect bow on your presence. Hi, Sandy. Hi, Tati. Thank you so much for having me. It is our pleasure. We all need this information, so let's get right into it. So first, how well, do you measure to make sure that the paper fits around the box? That's always kind of like well, a little bit of a puzzle. That is that does always get everybody. So I'll take this box. We didn't wrap it with paper, but basically what I do is I'll take the paper and measure it about to here. And then sim super simple, you just fold your bow, your box, you just move your box mm -hmm. and then take another like three inches on the other side. And that's how much paper you need. Oh, okay. Super so, simple. So no more wasting paper. No, oh. no wasting paper. In fact, we wrap, I have all these gift wrap ideas for you and none of them use paper. Oh, wow. Okay. So after you've cut the and paper though, for a bunch of different gifts, what do you recommend to do with the scraps? Well, the scraps can be used for all different kinds of things. You can actually do a collage which can be really fun, or you can take the scraps and put them on the back of the cards, and then now they can become um, of, of cards that you get, and now for next year, they can be um, cards that you add onto your gift. Okay, and you so can also use the scraps of paper as a gift card. So you just fold them in half, and then you just write your little note inside, so now the gift card matches the paper. All right, that's a great idea. Now let's talk about some of the things that you have in front of you. Walk us through those. Okay, so now this, this box that I just took out, you'd never guess that this was actually a cereal box. Oh, no way. So what you do is you take your cereal box, and you just, you just peel it open, oh. then you fold it backwards, and then what we did is we just, whoops, let me just put this out of here, and then we just stamp it, and then you fold oh. it back up, and you'd never know that this beautiful gift was made, was repurposed from a box that you have. Sandy, that is Super so simple. clever, and it's so pretty. It's, exactly, and you'd never guess what it was. Never. Then. Another thing that I just love to do is to give gifts in gifts. So what this is here is we've taken a, a little hat, and who doesn't love a, a hat for Christmas, especially when it starts getting cold? And I know where you guys are, it's very cold. Um, and then I put a bag of candy. So now you've got two gifts, because you've got the hat and the bag of candy. And then I wrapped it with a bow and an ornament. So now that's three gifts in one for under $10. That's very nice. Now tell us about something that you do with leftover empty ice cream containers. Oh, exactly. Well, you ruined the surprise, because I was going <laughs> to say, do you know what this is? <laughs> but it actually take you, because you cannot recycle frozen food containers. So all we did was just wrap a rope around this. You can use this any time of year. It doesn't just have to be for Christmas. And then we just decorated it up. And you really wouldn't know it was an ice cream container if we didn't already know. <laughs> no, it's absolutely beautiful. Sandy, where can people get more of your great ideas? Um, they can, I'm sure that you have a link on your blog or they can go to bodabra.com and just click on um, our how to section and we show you all kinds of ideas. Oh, thank you so much for being with us and sharing these great ideas. I think that I could implement a couple of them right away. Thanks, Sandy. Oh, everybody can and that's what's so cool. Yes, thanks so much.